a new challenger. Both fighters are ready to get started. I can't wait to see what kind of tricks they have up their sleeves. Let's see what they try and do here in this first round. Player two has the life lead. Still slugging it out here. Mm, denied up top. Checks with the projectile. The fireball game is so solid right now, their opponent can't get a good read to jump them. Ops for the anti-air. The corner makes it hard to escape. What'll be the setup here? Reads their mind and takes the throw. Puts the armor to good you. Both fighters are barely alive. Hit! Player two draws first blood and it's on the board. Can they keep the momentum? Tries to do something new and goes for the fireball. Combo with the target combo. Early round decisions are so important to set the tone. This is the perfect range to reach out and tag them with something. The gladius throws them away. What are they doing? Player one has the chance to win the round if they can put crowns them from above. A quick breather. Needs to fight Moses with the throw. Hitting them with the smart stuff. Marisa Player two gets a clear victory. I know they want to add more W to that column. Oh, we're going to run it back now. This thing ain't over yet. Sees it coming and shrugs off the attack with armor. It's a normal hit, but they get in there. Bites out of the corner, but not able to relax just yet. Escapes the corner to reset the situation. Takes the jump in. Takes a trip. Gets the jump in. Neither of them willing to give up ground here. Light lead opens up. Shoots off a fireball up close. Are you both exchanging numbers or something? Parries to cancel the fireball. One chip goes for the low risk air to air. Player one draws first blood and it's on the board. Can they keep the momentum? They both showed their hands a little bit, so they must be thinking of a counter. Going on the offensive? Combo with the target combo. Got it, sees it coming and shrugs off the attack with armor. The impact doesn't do anything. Uses the impact to shave off some of their drive gauge. There's a war going on in the middle of the stage. Barely hanging on. They have to optimize their drive use. Puts the armor to good you. Are we going to see a comeback here? Not going to hit. Green KO finish. Last round, people. Both fighters got to go all in from this point. Fight. Who's going to steal this win? That corner's going to make it. Crowns them from above. Keep them out. A jump? Player two with the rhythm owning that space. They switch sides. Wall slapping for the guard break. Yeah! Give them what they came to see. The good stuff. The top stuff. Oh! This is the path I have shown. A real test of nerves here. Player one has full drive gate. Too slippery to get a handle on. They can't get hit here. They're taking a step back to slow down the pace. It's over. Woo! I've seen a lot of fights in my day, but nothing, nothing even comes close to this one.
comes a new challenger. We got a good match on deck right now, and no one's gonna wanna blink once the action gets started. You call? Round one. Fight. Here we go. Let's see what these fighters have in store. Throws to get around their defense. Player two creates a good corner opportunity. Very nice anti-air there. They read their opponent like a book. Sticks the combo. All right, what's coming next? Knights him out of the air. Player two picks up the first round. That'll give him a psychological advantage. A brave forward jump there to start. Gets the jump in. Combo with the target combo. Player two needs to use the threat of the corner here. They gotta be careful not to overextend or their opponent might go for the side switch. Jumps! Jumps in! Gotta be careful not to whip at this range. Jumps up! The life remaining tells us that we're halfway through this round. But next with the medium kick. Not good Big girl. Oh, yeah. Medium kick hit. Back up on edge to throw connect. Okay, here we go. Any mistake here is gonna be fatal. What's it gonna be? Impact squash. What if it breaks them? What now? No way, no signs of letting up from out of that corner. Shit. This is gonna kill, no doubt about it. Final round. We're going into the final round tied up. Which fighter has it in them to grind out the win? Player two, what? In anti air. Barely blocks the jump in. Both fighters look to set things up as they continue to jostle for position. This is gonna hurt. Cross up attack. Very nice jump in there. Fights back with authority. What are they gonna do? This can lead to some big damage. A jump? Close range projectile. Jump! Crowns him from above. Jump! Reads the jump in perfect. What a smart throw! Run his counter or react The super connects! Everyone knew but you! The connects with the throw. What a statement with that fireball! Sets up with the jump in. Take that two has got to be feeling good getting the win out of that absolute party. Round it is one. not over. They want that run back. How's it going to unfold? But next with the medium kick. Goes for the jump in. You can open up chances to do big damage by baiting something out, getting that opening, and then jumping in. The throw hits. Now it's time for some fun. Mm, down. Tons of drive and hell toward it. It'll be interesting to see how both players utilize the drive gauge to dictate the terms of the match. Box him with the target combo. Throws to get around their defense. Player two creates a good corner opportunity. Hits! Player two picks up the first round. That'll give him a psychological advantage. Goes for the jump in to start the round. They both showed their hands a little bit, so they must be thinking of a counter. Projectile to try to change the situation. Fireballs are such good ground game tools, but you gotta be careful they don't get jumped. At this range, many attacks connect if you stick something out. The neutral game is so important here. Shows the medium kick. Goes for the jump in. Jump! Player two will look to apply pressure here. Picks up the counter. This is going to be huge. Are we going to see a comeback here? Digs in deep to get that drive attack. She shreds him with the critical part. Such a smart play goes to that situation. Fighting back against the odds and giving them a chance to win. Player two can't use any drive moves. Gotta play it safe. What now? 
Stay back down to regroup. This may be the final push. Oh my god, what hits the tip with the low heavy? Player 2 is a force to be reckoned with. a new challenger. Our fighters are ready to lay it all on the line. Let us begin. Don't expect me to be a pushover. Round one. Fight. Here we go. Let's see what these fighters have in store. Steel slugging it out here. Uses the target combo to take a chunk of damage off the opponent. There's a corner switch. Does not want to get stuck in the corner. Was looking for that jump attack. We've reached the midway point of the round and both fighters are at about even life. Player one can't let their drive gauge run out. They need to find a way to reset the situation. Let's see how they apply their corner pressure in this situation. All right, well, hell. Player one picks up the always important first round. They'll want to keep the ball rolling. Round two, fight. Instant jumping. Dash is up. Side switch out of the corner. Player two has a slight life lead. There's been some back and forth, but no clear leader in the fight. Player one can't use any drive moves without burning out. Gotta be careful not to whip this range. Knockdown and Shin Hakogeki is gonna sting. Jump, clutch, clutch, anti -air. Both sides getting ready. Uses that wall pressure. Player one gets a clear victory. I know they want to add more W to that column. It is not over. They want that run back. How's it going to unfold? Jumps in. If it's the start of the round, how will they start their approach? On dangerous turf. Easy to get tagged at this range. Tries to bait them with the projectile. Fireballs are such good ground game tools, but you gotta be careful they don't get jumped. Starts with the jump in. Somehow pushes back all the way to center stage. Knockdown. Gets the jump in. Overdrive by Shokeki for more damage. Ops with the throw to close it out. Player one picks up the first round. That'll give him a psychological advantage. Round two. Fight. Starts the party with a jump in. Everything up until now and everything from here on out is so vital. What patience to scout out the counterattack. Risky up close crap still going on. Knockdown and... Uses the fireball to try to get a reaction. Tries him open with the sure you can. Sets up with the jump in. Going in, experiencing burnout. Medium kick hits. Gotta be mindful of reach and jump in. His clutch, clutch, anti air. Or we breaks through with the throw. Player one gets a clear victory. I know they want to add more W to that column. a new challenger. How's this matchup gonna shake out? It's gonna be exciting to see. Let us begin. Round one. 
All right, first round. What's going to happen? Puts one in the pocket. Uses the downtime to get above. Not much damage dealt so far, but they may be looking for an opening to run with. Player one, pushes the opponent into the corner. Buy some time by driving them into the corner, and now they can create some big chances to do damage here. Uha stop to the brim. Look for them to turn up the heat now. Do well to get the buff in there. Good job blocking the jump in. They're showing us just how patient they can be. Blocking a jump in attack leaves you at a disadvantage, so it's better to try an anti-air instead. Both fighters decide to reset the pace and assess the situation. Easy tech. Goes for a projectile to try and change the pace. Nice tech. So they break forward to pressure the opponent. Life lead opens up. Throws him. What's next? Takes a trip. Ends the round with a punish counter. Living in the opponent's head rent free right now. Player one picks up the first round. That'll give him a psychological advantage. How will they take advantage of everything that's happened up until now? Player one has a slight life lead that they may sit on. There's been some back and forth, but no clear leader in the fight. Looking for a chance. Connects with the medium kick. Knockdown and takes the hit and keeps on truck. Decides to spend their gauge on the level two super art, Jin Hacho Geki. Player two is in a pretty good situation with the meter event. The throw connects. Who's gonna take it? They switch sides. Both absolutely refusing to give up ground. Wraps it up with the throw. Here's the final round. The real fight starts now. Final round. Opens with the jump in. Who will come out on top in this fight? Throw is denied. What a read. Wow, they are reading each other so well. Overhead attack. Lost by the play. Oh, here we go. Player one has knocked down. Here comes the mix up. Okay, fireball to the face. Player two was an absolute beast in that match. Round They're one. still hungry. Both sides stepping up for the rematch. Attempts to break the stalemate with a fireball. Fireballs are such good ground game tools, but you gotta be careful they don't get jumped. Will they hit, whip, charge in? Tricky territory here. Both sides have full drive and plenty of help. Let's see how things open up. Get down. Fair two. Push the opponent into the corner. Gonna tag on the super art here to turn up the heat. Secure the jump in. Get the buff in the meantime. Player two. Maintaining the corner pressure for some juicy damage. Easy tip. Rolls to get around their defense. Hit. Player one on the board first with the win. They'll want to keep the pressure on. Jumps in. All right, who's gonna swing first? It's the punish counter, but what are they going to do with it? Amazing concentration on display as they punish when their opponent's attack left them wide open. Fights out from the corner, back to the center of the stage. Oh, what an escape from the corner. Lots of Kuha Bank and plenty of avenues to race through. Punches that off and keeps going. Takes a chance with a friends, the meter on the super art. Burns a bar to unleash the storm to Kai Fuhaza. That punch counter creates a chance for some juicy damage here. Knockdown and sets up with the jump in. Wide lead here, but it's still anyone pay off. Last round, people. Both fighters gotta go all in from this point. Starts things off with a jump in. Solid anti-air. Go crowd him from above. Whips with the throw. There's an overdrive, I know. Reads the jump in perfect. This is gonna hurt. Running counter all reaction. That's how you force your opponent to do what you want so you can get a punish. Against all that juice on the super.
super art. Not shy one bit about it. Both sides getting ready. Player two can't let this simmer. They gotta start cooking. The thrill connect. The dragon pack doesn't work. But the air to air is good. What are they gonna do? Throw the anti air in the clutch. They didn't take that throw. Player one had to work extra for that one. Plenty of highs and lows in that match. It's not over. They want that run back. How's it going to unfold? Put the brakes on the impact. It's clipped by the anti-air. Consistent anti-air is huge because shutting down the air game lets you dictate the pace of the match much easier. Ops for the throw. Gets down. Old fighter sitting on a full drive gauge. This might be the prime time to let it rip. Looking for a way to incorporate their drive. There's a punish count. This can lead to something very big if they can capitalize. Maintains composure and fights out of the corner. All right, what's coming next? Got their eye on the air. Good job blocking the jump in. They're showing us just how patient they can be. Grabs them. Life lead opens up. That's some big juicy damage on that counter hit. Not close enough for the throw. Jump. It's there. Player one picks up the always important first round. They'll want to keep the ball rolling. Round two. Fight. Instant jumping. All right, who's gonna swing first? Player one did a great job of reading their opponent up close that last round. And they keep up the momentum. Connects with the medium kick. Takes the hit and keeps on trucking. At this range, many attacks connect if you stick something thick. It's a good spot to use the super. Uses the gauge for the super art. They want to show they're not playing well. What's wrong? Get up! Now can they finish the job? Player two is in a pretty good situation with the meter advantage. What separates the good from the great in this game is the smart meter manager. Zones with the fireball. Jumps up. You gotta be mindful of reach and jump ins at this range. Player two can't use any drive moves without burning out. The drive impact is denied. Nice block to shut out the impact. Ten Sinrin hits home. Player two is working with a better gauge. What can they do with experiencing burnout? Good heads up decision, opting for the drive impact. A quick breather. Noticeable life lead. Is a comeback still possible? Boyd's getting stuck in the corner somehow. A single hit will do it. This is my chance. Breaks through with the throw. Player one gets a clear victory. I know they want to add more W to that column.
Fighter 6.